Hello everyone, this is Yonan and today I'm gonna talk and body review Rock and Doll new slim body slash comparison between this version and another version, the oldest one, oldest one. And I need to mention here in this video I'm gonna remove uh, this clothes so she gonna be naked so there is uh, some naked dolls so if the if you sensitive please uh, don't watch this video and this is the measurement of uh, the body you can pause the video and see the details about it Head circumference uh, of this doll is 14.8 cm or 5.8 inches so she wore really small size wigs um, like uh, USD size uh, for this uh, wig I it's handmade by me and yeah this doll it is uh, I request this uh, default face up it is from the company uh, face up and uh, yeah uh, you can see I use this velcro um, stick here to just when I use the wig it does not slip off from uh, from the head there's a Monica this is the sculpt uh, name of this doll. This is the Raccoon doll logo, or uh, the something I don't know what the name is. And um, of course, she's attached by magnet here and there and in the cap. And of course, as you see here um, the doll attached by s hook and uh, places three places for the s hook I'm gonna show you later on in this video uh, what these for if you are wondering what is this white thing it is a silicon disc to make the movement of the head more um, control so this is the s hook uh, sorry the, um, the silicon disc um, yeah it is big a little bit but i don't mind it silicon disc job it just make the movement of the head more easier and hold the pose and of course it's not include with the dolls Okay, let's talk about the s hook placement with this uh, the place here. Um, I see this first time in uh, um, Apple House uh, and Raccoon Doll, the second place, which is yeah. So the movement it is really great side to side. So this is the s hook in the middle. Uh, so. Um, in all of them side to side it's not gonna change but uh, when I change the place of the s hook uh, the movement uh, like uh, back and forth it's gonna change as you see here that this, this is the first uh, place back it's not gonna work but forward it's work really really well with uh, the silicon disc or without the silicon disc doesn't matter so i love this option and um, i show you before with the second one which is the normal one this is the third one forward it's not gun bend but she can easily look up as you see i love this option a lot i wish all the dolls uh make or they make it yeah 
and this is the normal is hook place uh, which is the in the middle one so this is the movement forward and back it is not bad at all which is nice this doll uh, she can wear um, six millimeter and eight millimeters so this is the six the blue one the green one a uh, green one it is eight millimeter so both are perfect beautiful and there's no gaps whatsoever this is the eyes the oval uh, glass eyes this is how they look like and now I'm gonna show you the details of the body and just appreciate this sculpt it's so beautiful So this is the difference between the large uh, bust and the small bust. So as you see in the right one, it is the large one. In the left, it is the smallest one or the small bust. Okay, um, here we are gonna speak or talk about the chest uh, joint. She have only one single uh, joint under her uh, breast or chest. And um, the movement is nice from Rockwindall. I love it so much. Um, the problem is they have a gap, a really big gap. And this with from uh, like uh, the old version and the uh, newest versions all of them have the same gap and the movement are same for all the version of these uh, bodies as you see here we, they have these three i don't know what the name is actually and there's a small thing here just to hold uh, in place with these grooves I don't know what the name is but this is the movement forward and back okay let's talk about shoulder now shoulder joint it's smooth it is normal um but hold the pose uh, of course um and i don't even mention that she's a brand new doll so she's her straining is so strong so when i compare her with the oldest one they really old dolls so please yeah excuse that but about the posing, yeah, she's really beautifully uh, posing. So the elbow here, it's a proof to me. Like really like 
um, big, big change happened. It's so, 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 so change and so beautiful. Um, like, look at that. Look how uh, she posed. She easy for her to just touch her face. So this is Rosie, and uh, she's uh, in uh, the oldest uh, slim body, uh, the old version. And as you see here, the elbow movement is not good at all. Just like it is, it is double jointed, but movement like a single joint. As you see, it does not even work. And beside, she have really loose um, strings so yeah side to side the new one with this one it's absolutely a big huge different so at least we have some approved things yay this is the new one a new body it is a slim woman body uh vault 2 or something this is the version 2 but i don't like this body a lot but this before the news one that we talk about tonight and the, the elbow here it is good it is not bad but side to side with the newest one the newest one is gonna win obviously so even the sculpt the hand sculpt it's just a change and you see here it's a lot a lot of details the hands look so cool and detailed and um yeah and even the movement it's better it is not wow but it's better than before Of course, this is um, a pair of hands that I purchased with the doll, but it is not included with the doll, so you have to purchase with your own money or um, pay extra. And uh, I want just to show you the details how approved, just approved the dolls, like I mean the sculpt of the hand. This is the old uh, body and you see the difference between the hand. Oh my god, it's really, really changed, like to the better, of course. The movement of the hand is better, the sculpt of the hand is better, everything is better, better. The thigh joint, which is these uh, channels here um with the new version which is this body i don't really like it a lot it's okay but i don't like it a lot i'm gonna show you after a moment but it's okay to me so now this is the old version and I like it the most. I hope Raccoon Doll, he just make it again. Like, turn it back with the newest uh, body. Because these are so amazing. So the doll, she can pose like this. And put the, uh, like, uh, her uh, thigh side to side like that. It's nice. It is not limited for the movement. So this is really really beautiful so this is the side to side to me okay the look is not cool but whatever um this is the new one uh, or the slim uh, woman body um i don't like this thigh whatsoever the channel so um uh, like um not wide it's thin 
uh, this is the new it's more wider than um, the uh, than the oldest one did you see here yeah this is what I'm talking about mobility 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 joint which is my favorite 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 joint and the hold all like I love mobility joint um, I mean who doesn't <laughs> so he put back the mobility joint and uh, the first uh, first version uh, he, he already have it but in the second version he removed it and now he turned it back which is wow this is the old version and it's exactly the same yeah so the movement it's exactly the same there is no different this is side to side with the old version and the new version now i'm not uh, oh i hate this this is the um the old uh, version bef before our uh, newest one um the mobility it's there for just swivel side to side the thigh but it is not she can't even to touch her uh, or hug her knees or put this up whatsoever so this it's big nay nay to me knees joint it is almost almost all of them are same maybe there's a little bit of different of course with the newest one it's better but all of them to me it's same same looks but maybe um and the movement it's same exactly uh this is the old uh, version uh, as you see it's exactly the same also and this is the second version and also the same maybe the looks it's more thinner and that's it and as I mentioned before these two version are old so the straining is so old so yeah loose feet joint it is not the best but it's okay all right um, yeah about the the feet scalp it's approved it's nice um, more thinner but the movement it's just regular yeah so it's average there's no even a lot of movement this is the difference between the flat feet and the high feet uh, high heel feet this is the high heel it is um, came with a doll for free and I really appreciate that and uh, yeah this is the difference between them about the movement it is exactly the same there is no like big change it is exactly the same But there's a huge different uh, between the old version and the newest version. As you see, it's a little bit longer and thinner as a leg. And the sculpt uh, feet, it just looks amazing. And uh, this is the second uh, version, the slim one. Um, it is same, same exact uh, feet.
And this is all the skin color that I have from Raccoon Doll, White Skin, Rose Mocha Skin, and uh, there is uh, Sweet Mocha Skin and Dark Mocha Skin. I'm honestly struggle to put this two side to side without stand. Um, of course, there's a difference between the stand here, as you see, um, and both without shoes, but it's really big difference, like really big difference, as you see. Um, of course, this is Kai from Rock and Doll, and um, he's the man. He's the man. He's so tall, so wide. Oh my god. I try my best to hold him without stand. And that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoy um, with me in this video and found it helpful and beneficial for you. And um, of course, if you have any questions, just leave it down below in the comment section. If you like this video, just um, share it with, you, with your friend and um, um, subscribe if you don't have it, if you not have it already. And um, yeah, do all the good these things, like and comment and share. Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next one, guys. Bye.